Ansar Allah Media Office which is the Houthi group's media arm released footage late Monday of launching what Houthis claim a hypersonic ballistic missile that landed in an open area in central Israel early Sunday. A missile fired by Yemen's Iran-backed rebels landed in an open area in central Israel early Sunday and triggered air raid sirens at its international airport, in the latest reverberation from the nearly year-long war in Gaza. There were no reports of casualties or major damage, but Israeli media aired footage showing people racing to shelters in Ben Gurion International Airport. The airport authority said it resumed normal operations shortly thereafter. The Yemeni rebels, known as Houthis, have repeatedly fired drones and missiles toward Israel since the start of the war in Gaza between Israel and the Palestinian militant group Hamas, but nearly all of them have been intercepted over the Red Sea. Brig General Yehya Sari, a military spokesman for the rebels, said they fired a ballistic missile at a military target in Jaffa, which is part of Tel Aviv. Yemen's Houthi rebels claimed Monday that they shot down another American-made MQ-9 Reaper drone. A video circulating online showed what appeared to be a surface-to-air missile strike and flaming wreckage strewn across the ground. The U.S. military did not immediately respond to a request for comment on the Houthis' claimed downing of a drone over the country's southwestern Damar province. The Houthis have exaggerated claims in the past in their ongoing campaign targeting shipping in the Red Sea over the Israel-Hamas war in the Gaza Strip. However, the online video bolstered the claim, particularly after two recent claims by the Houthis included no evidence. Other videos showed armed rebels gathered around the flaming wreckage, a propeller similar to those used by the armed drone visible in the flames. Brig General Yehya Sari, a Houthi military spokesperson, identified the drone as an MQ-9, without elaborating on how he came to the determination. He said it was the third downed by the group in a week, though the other two claims did not include similar video or other evidence. The US military similarly has not acknowledged losing any aircraft. Sari said the Houthis used a locally produced missile. However, Iran has armed the rebels with a surface-to-air missile known as the 358 for years. Iran denies arming the rebels, though Tehran manufactured weaponry has been found on the battlefield and in seaborne shipments heading to Yemen despite a United Nations arms embargo. Reapers, which cost around $30 million apiece, can fly at altitudes up to 50,000 feet and have an endurance of up to 24 hours before needing to land. The aircraft have been flown by both the U.S. military and the CIA over Yemen for years. The Houthis have targeted more than 80 merchant vessels with missiles and drones since the war in Gaza started in October. They seized one vessel and sank two in the campaign that has also killed four sailors. <laughs> في أجواء محافظة دمار 
حيث كانت الطائرة تنفذ مهام عدائية حيث كانت الطائرة تنفذ مهام عدائية وقد تم إسقاط الطائرة بصاروخ أرض جو محلي الصنع وتعد هذه الطائرة هي الثالثة خلال أسبوع والعاشرة من هذا النوع والتي تتمكن دفاعاتنا الجوية من إسقاطها في معركة الفتح الموعود والجهاد المقدس إسنادا لغزة <تصفيق>